Now that everything is ready to go live, go through your translated pages and review for these three important parts. The first one is translation quality. For marketing, e-commerce, or even simple blog pages, ChatGPT is usually good enough with a human review. For legal, medical, or high-stakes content like a homepage or pricing, always have a professional do a final proofread to avoid misunderstandings. Then make sure to check your pages for design issues. For example, some languages like German take up more space, which can cause issues on menus and buttons. Let me show you on our website. As you can see, that it becomes instantly more text heavy. So you need to make sure that your website design is responsive to expand for it. And also think of right to left languages like Arabic that require a different page orientation. As you can see, our orientation changed like this. So your website needs to account for that. Finally, images with text can benefit from translation too. So consider uploading localized images on your localized pages. Lastly, consider dynamic content limitations. If your website includes dynamic content like blog feeds, pricing widgets, product filters, ChatGPT can't help you handle that directly, but it can help you create logic in your CMS.